Hello Internet people, this is Meteor Bolt about to strike with episode 6 of my Let's Play series on new Pokemon Snap. Now, I just unlocked uh, the ability to travel to the jungle region at night, but at the moment I would rather return to the very first area of the game and uh, try to discover some more of its secrets and see if I can photograph any ancient ruins in the region. They seem to be in a couple of regions so far, so they might be in all of them. I'm also going to review any requests that may be relevant to the area, such as this one, Hard One Happiness. Pidgeot's cool, but it's kind of distant. Think it'd warm up to you for a fluff fruit or two? So I need to try to get a, a f uh, entice Pidgeot into eating a fluff fruit. And this one I have to try to photograph the Pokemon scorching these fruits. And then that's that's one for at night. Yeah. Uh, this one's for during the day. Sometimes the Lord just seems to gather natural power from its surroundings. Would you mind getting a photograph of this striking behavior? I'm not sure what natural power means, but we'll give it a shot. Hi. But yeah, here. Let's return to park during the day. We've only been in this region one time after we gained the fluff fruit power. Take care. So, let's see what we can see. Hi, Pichu. Haven't got a good one of you yet. There we go, we got it eating. Yep. What is that? That is a really good photo of that guy. I couldn't even really see him before. I don't see any ancient ruins yet. to kind of look in directions that I haven't really looked much before. Swimming! Got one of them swimming. That's got to be a new behavior. That's right, Tangrove likes these.
Where is Florence? Okay, over there. It's time. Definitely got some new behaviors there. Don't know if I, I don't think I completed any of the requests or found any ruins. What was it? Well, we'll take a look. We'll see if anything stood out. Got a two star photo of Florges. One of it eating. Let's see. These are all two star photos of it. New with Bivalon. That's a better one of Pichu. Yeah, this one, it's angry. It almost looks like it's trying to eat that butterfly. But, okay, this one's better. Yeah, it's in flight, it's cute. That might be a better photo. What? Even the one where it's swimming is just a one star? What do I gotta do to get a, mo a multi, multi star? Got one of this guy. That's a pretty good picture. Okay, nothing earth shattering. better photo than that last one. Mm. So we got Florges. It's a pretty poor score for two star. Okay, I think that's a better nice one of you two because it's bigger. Still hiding in the grass, though. Nice work. This one's got a lot of them in the background there. Mm. And this one's a three star. Not a bad photo. Mm. Mm. This one's pretty good too. Don't know why the post score is so bad. 200. Nice work. <laughs> no, no it's not. One could be better. Nope, same. Nice work. Hmm. Nice work. Yeah, I forgot. Swana takes his breath away. Yeah, 
Yeah, that's a photo I can be prouder of. A two-star photo of Wurmple because it's been bopped by something. Seems like there's an er a version of every Pokemon that looks like it's been bopped by something. Still not going to go to level mm -hmm. 3 for another probably two more visits. Together with friends, score of 500 points or more in the other Pokemon category. We can save a few of these. I like that one. And I kind of like this one. <laughs> Expand. I like this one. The floor just eating. Chow time. Cute how it picks humorous uh, captions for your photos for you. Go back to the jungle area at night. Oh. <laughs> All right, no idea what we'll be able to see here. this music. It's pretty dark out there. You might have a hard time finding Pokemon. Look for a glowing crystal bloom for me, would you? What is this? Morlo? I have no idea what that's supposed to be. Looked like they were like dancing in a parade. Awesome! Ariados. Oh! One of the b spider Pokemon. Didn't look like it was glowing. Ladybug guys. Lipards like to sleep at night as well as during the day, apparently. Can I knock it out of the tree? I am 
having a hard, harder time locating any Pokemon. Ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Where'd they go? Hey. Alright, I guess I will have a photo of Toucan and... Even if it's a really far away bad one. Ooh, there's four of those guys right there. Oh, got the bopped him. The, the one that looks like he's been bopped by something. Oh, really? That one looks happy. Ooh, more magic card. Is that nice? Is he gonna land and try to eat that? Yeah. <laughs> wonderful, wonderful. I don't see any glowing. Oh, there's one. That one's glowing. Oh boy, that guy looks happy. Here's the cave. Maybe there's something in it. There's something. <gasps> yes. I think it was one of those dragonfly guys, but it was hanging upside down. I knew there was going to be something cool in that cave at some point. You're gonna be impressed by these photos, man. Not that one. That one's a bad one. And these are all bad ones. Why not look at that one? We got some of our box sleeping, and one of it a little bit awake. We got only one star photos of this. So, that or that? I'm thinking that. Where are the two star photos? Okay. I guess I like that one better. Yes, I knew I got this one in several different states. Three different states. We got normal state, eating a thing state, and the third state, hanging upside down in a cave. Quagsire. Three star photos, all of them. So. Is there more? Not, not better than that. Only got this one in one state. So there we go. Two cannon. Oh man, it's too far away. I can't even register. Yep, not clearly visible. Well then why can't I register that one a Magikarp earlier? 
Uh, let's see. That's the best one. Alright. Professor. I am becoming a very good camera genius now. Oh, it's Lipard. Something gallant about it, don't you think? Nice work. What fascinating behavior. It's like it's been bumped by something. I love being rewarded for bopping things. This has got to be a good photo. Nice work. Fast asleep. Pretty big. Other Pokemon. Yeah. That's a good one. And this is a good one, but it was very easy nice to work. get. A new discovery. Nice work. It's holding on to a branch while it sleeps. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. Eyes, direction, placement. I should get points for background. It's in a cool little green glowing cave. Mm. Nice work. Looks like it's fast asleep, which is a three star pose, apparently. I got over 4,000 points, so I get the sparkly, glowing stars. Ledian. Nice work. Fascinating behavior, he says. A new discovery. Bello Silva Island Crystal Blue. This is the first time you photographed one in the Illumina State. I know. This is the first time I've seen the Illumina phenomenon caught on camera outside of what we've seen on Florio. Research level went up a lot of points in that one go. Looks like you've got the hang of nighttime research. Keep up the good work. You got a sticker. You registered seven species of bug type Pokemon to your photo decks. Nice. Cool. By the way, now that we've got that Crystal Bloom info, I've got something to report. I hope you're excited. I am. Because I don't know what he's going to report now. Maybe unlock a new area. Maybe give me new powers. I hope it's new powers. I couldn't register all these different states for Yan Mega. I got it doing all kinds of stuff. Okay, what do we have to look forward to now? Yep. 
Great job. Your photos gave us plenty of data to work with. Now, then. now I've got something new to show you. Take a look. Oh. It's a blue prism thing. Oh, are those the orb thingies you've been working on, Professor? Didn't you say they can make Pokemon and Crystal Blooms glow? Mm -hmm. Exactly. I call them Illumina Orbs. Unfortunately, blue Illumina Orbs only work here on Florio Island. Huh? What? How come? I suspect it's because different areas of Lental have diff distinct types of energy flowing through them. Now then. But for now, want to see the fruits of your research in action? Oh, now, now it's yellow. Watch this. Observe. Hmm. Makes the nice. flowers glow. That was awesome. Ooh. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Huh. Wow, Lintel's very own light show. Well, what did you call it again? The Illumina Phenomenon? It's interesting how it can occur in both Pokemon and plants. Well, some Pokemon are plants, my friend. You can use these orbs to send Pokemon and Crystal Bloom into the Illumina state for a little while. When you do, watch for changes in their surroundings. Can we have some of the orbs that work here on Florio? Of course you can. We're going to have to try these out back at the nature park. You obtained Illumina Orbs for Florio Island. You obtained Illumina Orbs for ba Balusilva Island. You obtained Illumina Orbs for Bellows... Uh, oh, that's a profile icon. Okay. Cool. Okay, new requests. Don't be scared. Comfy always ran run away from me. I wonder how I could get them to be my friends. I don't know, maybe if we activate the flowers. Sudden movement. I saw a tan growth suddenly move in the most amazing way. I was too slow to get a good photo of it, though. Mind giving it a try? Move in it. You know, I saw ar its arms, like, reaching into the picture at some point. I wasn't sure what that meant or whether it was a mistake or what, but I guess not. Hey, I just heard Dodrio can fly. I've never seen one do that before, have you? Uh, I didn't know it could fly. I thought it was a three-headed ostrich. Dancing with the Queen. Co and B are very devoted to Vespiquen. Vespiquen. If you observe them closely, you'll see that these Pokémon do more than just gather nectar. Interesting. For whose sake? Do you know what motivates Combi to work so hard? You may find out if you search this area carefully. Seems to be lots of mysteries and interesting things to uncover in this game. I heard a really loud noise and it got me wondering. Do you think Arbok ever falls out of its tree while it's sleeping? I was wondering the same thing. I don't seem to be able to affect it enough to knock it out of the tree with a f fluff root. But, all right. I think I'll try one more expedition before I close out this video. It'll be an extra long video. I bet Illumina Orbs will, find, will help us find new stuff to research on the courses we visited. I think so too. Let's head back to the first course.
Oh, I just realized. They didn't tell me how to use the orbs. Okay, so it's the Y button. Got it. Interesting. Looks like I can make just about any Pokemon glow. What was that that just flew by? Is that a good one? I guess I didn't get a picture of Bidoof building a dam before. It's probably a different state. If I got anything interesting that time. It seems to to me the ways to use the orb things are not as obvious as I thought. pictures of anything in a new state. Huh. Let's do this. 
Time to check these photos. Nice work. Hmm. Well, it's all around better than that other one. Great timing. Slightly better than that other one because there's more po Pokemon in there and they're bigger. Okay, this is not going to be as good as that one. Nice work. I don't know about this one. a cute photo. I might save it. My album. Mm. Great timing. Now, now this you don't see every day. Good work. This is no easy shot to get. Okay. I wonder if that. I don't know if that fulfilled the request or not. I don't know if it was nice work. getting natural power from its. Environment or not. Nice work. This one's a little bit closer than the last one. No, not as good, though. Yeah, I didn't get that many points that time. Alright, save a couple photos to album. We'll come back another time. I think maybe just that one. Yeah, that's all I need to save. Looking forward to learning more about how to use these orb things. Yeah. Kind of mysterious. Okay, uh, that's gonna conclude this video. Uh, keep an eye out for episode seven in the near future. If you like this video, please please give it a like. Uh, leave a comment. Share it on social media. Subscribe to my channel, and uh, yeah, Meteor Bolt has struck.